In this video we will discuss about the GAGUN. GAGUN stands for GPS Aided Geo Augmented Navigation. GAGUN Space Based Augmentation System provide augmented information for satellite navigation to aircraft flying over Indian airspace. A joint initiative by Airport Authority of India and Indian Space Research Organization. Indian Navigation Reference Earth Stations have been established throughout India, with equipment supplied by Raytheon. Developed to provide satellite-based navigation services with accuracy and integrity required for civil aviation applications. There are two important sources of GNSS-derived position errors, satellite errors and signal propagation delays. Satellite errors such as clock and positional errors apply to users irrespective of location. Satellite errors if corrected, will improve the receiver accuracy. GNSS signal delays are specific to user location. The conditions prevailing in the ionosphere, through which the satellite signal pass. It is necessary for a user to correct signal errors to improve the positional accuracy. Interoperability. Gagun has been designed to meet International Civil Aviation Organization defined standards on space-based augmentation system. It is compatible to other space-based augmentation systems in the world and promises to provide seamless navigation. Operational System. Three geostationary satellites. GSAT-8 and 10 are positioned above the equator at longitudes 55 degree east and 82 degree east. The two satellites broadcast the same message ensuring system redundancy. A third satellite, GSAT-15, is positioned at 83 degree east. This will serve as in-orbit reserve to be used when either GSAT-8 or 10 fails. 15 Indian Reference Stations A network of precisely surveyed ground reference stations is strategically positioned across the country to collect, GPS, satellite data. This data is sent to the Indian Master Control Centers located at Bengaluru. Two Indian Master Control Centers The Indian Master Control Center uses the data from 15 reference stations to calculate the differential corrections and the ionospheric delays for each of the monitored GPS satellites and the ionospheric grid points. Thus, Indian Master Control Centers computes errors in GPS position, do corrections and determines integrity. 3. Indian Land Uplink Stations The SBAS messages from Indian Master Control Centers are uplinked to geostationary satellites GSAT-8 and 10 from Indian Land Uplink Stations. Geostationary satellites then broadcast messages on GPS frequency but with different data rate and PRN code. This allows SBAS compatible receivers to identify these satellites and receive, decode and process the correction and integrity data. Now we will discuss about the Gagun ground configuration. Gagun has two data communication networks. Robust communication network. Stringent data transportation requirement with 99.999% availability. Gagun consists of set of ground reference stations positioned across various locations in India called Indian Reference Station, which tracks all the GPS satellites and SBAS Geo in view and forward all measurement data to Master Control Center for further processing. 2. Master Control Station Indian Master Control Center collects data from reference stations and create GPS correction messages. Indian Land Uplink Station the corrected differential messages are uplink via Indian uplink station to the geostationary satellite. Gagun Space Segment Broadcasts correction and integrity information to user community. The information on this signal is compatible with basic GPS signal structure, which means any SBAS-enabled GPS receiver can read this signal. Gagun will boost efficiency, reduction in delays, diversions, missed approaches and cancellations of flights due visibility minima. Improved safety during landing, vertical guidance improves safety, especially in adverse weather conditions. Reduction in fuel consumption, approach with vertical guidance procedures will help facilitate better energy and descent profile management during the final approach. Now we will discuss the key points. Gagun is a system of satellites and ground stations that provide GPS signal corrections, giving you better position accuracy. Gagun is the acronym for GPS-aided geo-augmented navigation. 
it uses a constellation of satellites and a network of ground stations to provide necessary augmentations to the GPS standard positioning service navigation signal for use in air traffic management. Gagun is designed to provide accuracy and integrity necessary to enable reliance on GPS for all phases of flight from en route through approach for all qualified airports within the covered zone. Gagun is the first SBAS in the world certified for approach with vertical guidance operating in the equatorial ionospheric region and it is the third SBAS who have achieved feet after WAS of USA, EGNOS of Europe and MSAS of Japan. One essential component of the Gagun project is the study of the ionospheric behavior over the Indian region. Gagun ionospheric algorithm was developed by ISRO. This makes India the third country in the world which has such precision approach capabilities. The Gagun system provides non-precision approach service, accurate to within the radius of one-tenth of a nautical mile, required navigation performance or RNP 0.1 over the 100% Indian fur and, approach with vertical guidance over the 76% of Indian landmass, over 99% availability. Gagun SBAS will enable in reducing dependency on ground-based infrastructure and leverage the precision and accuracy provided by satellite technologies. Suitably certified Gagun system can provide approach procedures to runway ends to minima as low as 250 feet close to ILS Category 1. Gagun approach procedures provide accuracy of an ILS without the limitations of localizer or glide slope interference. GNSS can support an unlimited number of users at any point of time, allowing for denser traffic and limitless expansion. In order to enable Gagun SBAS operation, 1. Aircraft needs to be equipped with a certified SBAS receiver. 2. DGCA must approve the Gagun SBAS operations. 3. Airport runway must qualify for such operations, and 4. Associated Gagun approach procedures must be approved for such airport. Gagun Geo footprint expands from Africa to Australia and Gagun system has capability to cater 45 reference stations for expansion to neighboring countries. The system is interoperable with other international SBAS systems and provides seamless air navigation across regional boundaries.